Hi there, graders. Happy Wednesday. All right, so today we are going to be taking our edge elastic quiz over the multiple step word problems that we've been working on the past almost two weeks now. So this is going to be on edge elastic. Again, it is going to be assigned in your home room, okay? So I'm going to click on my home room, and it is called AT.3 Multi-Step Word Problems, okay? It has like a bluish purple background with an orange light bulb. Let's take a look at it. Make sure that you have some scrap paper when you work on this, okay? Let's try again. Sometimes it doesn't like me very much. Ah, there we go. Okay. Number one, Micah bought one pair of jeans for $24 and three shirts for $9 each. How much did Micah spend in all? Okay, multiple choice. Make sure that you're working it on on your scrappy paper. Number two, two people each bake a batch of nine brownies. They want to share the total amount of brownies with a group of six friends. How many brownies will each of the six friends get? So each of the two people baked nine brownies each. Number three, Emma has a bag of 180 peaches. She uses 126 of them to make pies for a bake sale. She divides the rest equally among six friends. She wants to know how many peaches each friend gets. Which equations should she use? Choose all that apply. So this time you're choosing the equations that you would write on your scrap paper to solve this problem. And since it says choose all that apply, there may be one answer, there may be two, there may be three, it could be all of them, but you have to make sure you look at each and every single one. Finally, a flower shop has 426 flowers. This week, they sell 285 flowers. At the end of the week, the shop gets a delivery of 310 more flowers. How many flowers does the flower shop have now? All right, and that's all of them. So again, make sure that you are using scrap paper. You can take a screenshot of this so that you can use cubes right directly on the problem. And please, please make sure that you get this quiz done by 3 o'clock on Sunday so that your teachers can see how you did and put it in the grade book. I'll talk to you on Friday.